A pregnant Duchess of Cambridge looked relieved to take the weight off her feet today, on a visit to a design museum following a busy day, with Prince William on their royal tour of Sweden. Smiling Kate, who is around six months pregnant, sat in the unusual seat as the pair toured the Arc des Museum, a national centre devoted to the best in architecture and design, in Stockholm. The couple looked enthralled as they were given a guided tour of the attraction, in the Swedish capital. Alongside up-and-coming brands, the pair also saw some iconic IKEA creations, days after the Swedish furniture firm's founder Ingva Kamprad passed away. The Duchess of Cambridge hid her baby bump beneath a green dress, but ditched the controversial faux fur hat she sported earlier, in the day. This morning the couple had played bandy hockey, with William triumphing against his wife in a penalty shootout. Bandy has similarities to both hockey and football as a small ball instead of a puck is used, with teams of 11 playing, on ice rinks using curved sticks. But despite Kate being an accomplished hockey player, who was a member of both her school and university teams, Prince William triumphed smashing in two goals to his wife's one. Anna Whiting, an international bandy player, who coached the royal couple before the shootout, said, I could see that maybe they liked to beat each other. Also they were pushing each other to do well. She said, Kate had played field hockey and I was expecting her to be good, and she was very good. She knew how to hold the stick and she had a very good swing. I was impressed. The royal couple started their day with a hot drink from a flask carried in a case, known as a bandy portfolge, bandy briefcase, to keep out the sub-zero temperatures at the snowy Stockholm Park where the match was staged. After their introduction to the sport, they headed to the Royal Palace for a lunch. It was hosted by King Carl XVI Gustav and Queen Sylvia, and 15 other members of the Royal Court, including Crown Princess Victoria and her husband Prince Daniel. They then took a walk through the cobbled streets, before arriving at the museum. Today was the first of a two-day trip to Stockholm. And the couple will move on to Norway, on Thursday for another two-day stay.